Welcome to this short video on our filtering commands. We have multiple filtering commands and I'm going to try to demonstrate some of them. So if I come up here to the Kobe Toolkit, on over here to Selection, I've got a few different options in here. And if I select on Select, here's multiple options. So I can actually select everything in the same category, the same family, the same type, and a bounding whether it's the host or if it's hosted and a work set. So we have all those different options. We also have this filter command. So if I select on the filter command, it brings up a dialog box. Inside in here, we can decide whether we're just doing the active view or from a model, or if we had something selected also. We can also include annotation categories. We also give you the ability of how you group these. So at the moment it's set to category, but we could say, let's change it to work sets. We can change it by level, by room, and so on. And so what this allows me to do is I can go in and select certain objects. So if you ever get that pesky drawing floating around in your, in your model, which here I've got a drawing, if I go ahead and select this and I go, okay, now I can hit the delete key now if I come back up here to filter, I'm going to go back to the model. Let's go back down to the bottom. We'll see now that that drawing is gone. Okay, so let's cancel this. Next one I want to show you is our modeless. So if I select on modeless, what this allows me to do is do that filtering while I'm still working in the model. So for instance, I might just select this window here. As you can see, I've selected the window. If I come in here, you'll see that I've got a window selected and I can drill right down and see the exact window that I have selected. Or vice versa, I could say, well, let's select all of the windows. And so as you can see in the background, I've selected all of the windows. And same thing, we have ways to be able to group this so we can go by level, by room, and so on. Okay, so let's go back to category. We also have the way to filter. So we can go in here and say, let's go to windows. And there you can see we can filter that way also. So what else we can do is we can select one window here. I can come down and click on the little magnifying glass and it's going to take me right to that location. I'm going to go ahead and exit this. And this concludes this short video on filter. I hope you enjoyed it and thanks for watching.